What's going on guys? Let's go ahead and work on our false statement in this video or our else statement in this video to see if there's any errors when we're updating information to our database. So when we are start up here from content.php, say that we had an error right here or we didn't have um, a correct, like we just took this all out or something and we edited the information. I want this to show up and say like there's an error in the database or give it like an asterisk or something like that you know when you're signing up for like Facebook or MySpace or something and you don't have the correct information they'll spit something back let's go ahead and create that so let's go to our let's code right here and I'm gonna go ahead and create another variable called message And we'll just say uh, the information was an epic fail. Let's go ahead and close that out. And I'm going to go ahead and concatenate to this variable that we just created. So I'm going to use the, nope, not even close. Third time's a charm. There it is. I'll just give it a HTML break tag. And I'm going to concatenate the PHP function MySQL error. And let me look at this. Let's go ahead and right that would happen here. Go down to our else statement right down here. Let's go ahead and use this variable. We'll set it equal to there were give it a space dot count PHP function what is the error that we used how to collect our errors I believe it was error or errors let's go up to the top really quick errors with an s okay sorry about that and we'll give it another space and we'll just say too many errors in the form we blew it Let's go ahead and save that. Let's go back to our form right now. Click on this is Village Park. Say we'll take this out and we'll try to update nothing. Let's go ahead and edit information. Boom, there are there are one too many errors in this form because we don't want to update nothing. We don't want to submit nothing. We don't want to submit a null value. So hopefully you guys follow along with this code. In the next video, maybe we'll talk about putting like an asterisk right here, letting us know that this is a required field. Alright guys, good luck with this. I'll see you guys in the next video.